Hello everybody, this is Nada and welcome to my channel where only you have the power to build your world. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the iPhones and checking the IEM to make sure that the iPhone is paid off. So if you plan on buying an iPhone or selling one, make sure you watch this video all the way through because I will show you how you can check the IEM to make sure that the phone is paid off. Simply because if the phone is not paid off, you will not be able to use the phone properly. Most of the time when you run the IEM number, especially on the iPhone, it will give you all the information that you need. For example, how many gigs the phone is, what version is on, what carrier, if it's unlocked, reported stolen, reported lost, all that good information. But the scammers have gotten real smart. They're pretty much buying phones on credit and then selling them online to make a profit. So the only way you can catch this scam is pretty much checking the IEM number to make sure that the iPhone is paid off. And you're probably asking yourself, how can I check if the phone is paid off? The best way to check if the phone is paid off is by checking the links out in the description box below. I will have all four links for the top carriers in the United States, Verizon, Sprint, T-Mobile, and AT&T. So if you're buying one of these phones that's from one of these providers, I'll have all four links in the description box below where you are able to simply click on the link, enter your IEM number of the phone that you are buying. This will let you know if the phone is paid off. Also, it will let you know if there's any balance due on the phone. This is very important, especially if you're buying a phone from an individual online that you never met. You want to make sure that the phone is paid off. If the phone is not paid off, two things can happen. Either you're going to have to pay off the balance or the person pretty much is going to report the phone lost or stolen and then you're going to end up with a brick that you're not going to be able to do nothing with. This two minute check will save you a lot of time and hopefully save you a ton of money. This way you do not get scammed. So now I will show you the step by step process for each carrier on Pretty much check and see if the phone is paid off. I'll pretty much show a screen right here with step one, step two, and step three that you have to take. And I'll have all the steps and the links in the description box below. Make it super easy and convenient. All right, so if you're using the Verizon carrier, all you have to do is click on the Verizon link I'll have in the description box below. And then press continue as guest on the pop-up. And then select the phone manufacturer, model, memory size, and color and then enter your IEM. This will also give you a trade-in value. Also, it will let you know if the phone has a balance on it. Now, if you're buying an AT&T phone, it is only three steps. You simply click on the AT&T link in the description box below. Step number two, click on unlock your device and then answer no when they ask you the question, are you an AT&T wireless customer? And then input your IEM number into the form and then it will pretty much give you a message saying that either the phone is paid off or that the phone has payments on it. For T-Mobile, it is only two steps. All you have to do is click on the link in the description box below and then enter your IEM number, status check form, and then you will receive a message from the carrier stating the balance due on the phone. If it's zero, that means the phone is paid off. If it's a different number, that means the phone is not paid off. And for Sprint, it is also two steps. Step one, click on the link in the description box below. Step number two, enter your IEM number in the form, and then you'll receive a message, either the phone is paid off or the phone has a balance. Very easy, very simple. So there you go, everybody. A simple process that you can use when buying your next iPhone to make sure it's clean and to make sure it is paid off. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video. Peace out.